Hey guys, what's up? Kazumi can forget another video and welcome back to the road to Paper Mario 3DS Part 3 episode number 8 this time. In the previous episode, we got a lot of progress done since it was, you know, Sunday. We got a really nice 40 minute plus episode. And uh, so, yeah, we got, we collected the 1 million rubies and... Uh, yeah, that was pretty awesome. And in this episode, we're going to be hope well, not hopefully, but we are going to be continuing and um, maybe finishing chapter uh, two. Now, I'm going to be explaining why this commentary is a little bit awkward because I'm actually post commentating this. I'm going to be talking about this, um, you know, just right now uh, after we save our progress, which is going to be in a couple of seconds. So with that, I'll see you guys in one second. The mysterious handmaid Mimi disappear in the bizarre explosion. What exactly was her plan, and why did she try to enslave Mario and friends? After the incident, Princess Peach noticed stairs going down. Here we go, she said. I wonder if Merle is down here. Though our hero uh, thought our heroes as they traded worry uh, worried glances. A two saw a Somali made their way down, knowing there was no other path to follow. Here we are at chapter 2-4, The Basement Face-Off. The pure heart is near. I feel its tremor so much more strongly down here. Ah, hooray, Whippy! Thanks for coming to look for me. Beautiful, mysterious Merle, mistress of the house. It's me. It's uh, so so glad it's uh, it's you. I see. So long, I've waited for you. Your arrival is well past due. But we can't be like this. So no, something for uh, for something's amiss. An evil one is after me. Since safe and sound, I cannot be. In the basement, do uh, I dwell? Maze-like rooms are my cell. You will find me. I can tell. And if you do, take care, for your eyes may er, trust nothing foul or fair. No, I cannot last. My power is fading. Fast. The distance is too vast. Are you ready to find me? Beware if you do, I plea. Uh. She's gone. Was that apparition really Merly? Why do you suppose she was telling us to be careful when we find her? And on that note, here we are at Merle's basement now. So, uh, you know, uh, the, the, the first thing that I want to say when opening, uh, you know, this episode, because it's, it's really, really quick. You want to go 3D and hop down here to get an easy uh, one, uh, thousand points uh, mushroom, which is pretty awesome. Now, I do have to say that uh, while I'm going to be talking this in the way of where we need to go. So, actually... Uh, I did a really, really uh, bad mistake. When I announced my uh, Facebook and Twitter page uh, opening, if you want to call it that, I, you know, sort of uh, did something really, really wrong, which was um, I changed my audio recording preferences to the microphone in my laptop. And when recording, I actually did not change that back. So... I, you know, started, uh, you know, sort of editing, editing episode 8 uh, on Sunday, only to find out that the audio was a piece of shit, and here I am, Sunday at 11.05, making this video, and then I will have to edit, so it's actually not going to be that, you know, that pretty for me although I'm really not that tired but I'm, I'm you know I'm just I'm just going to be telling you about my Sunday uh, and then I just want your guys's feedback and how was your Sunday but here we have something of, mo of uh, more importance for the gameplay which is ah yes how very nice thanks for coming thank you twice oh it looks like it's Merle pretty cool so we're going to be having our pure heart mysterious and lovely mistress of the house you see it's me Merle I, sh I shine on, such is my lot, a son those fate to, to me brought. And I knew that soon I'd see you bust and buy, little beast. <laughs> okay, that sounds a little bit weird, I have to admit. We've come singing the pure heart. Oh, yes, of course, I know, the pure heart for Mario and company. For you, yes, I'll gladly part with, a with that purest pure heart. 
Mm, but there is a wee fee. Yes, uh, yes, uh, 10 million rubies. Quite a bargain here, agree? So, folks, uh, if you'd be dear, sign the dotted line here, and it's yours free and clear. So, I don't really know why a descendant of the Ancient Ones would charge the Hero of the Prophecy for a pure heart, something that we need for, you know, the, the hope of every single world in existence, so I'm going to be refusing. Uh, if you like the rubies now, a sm smallish loan I can allow. You can work it off somehow. Just sign here, my dear. Uh, she's going to be uh, per just persuading you into saying, uh, okay, so uh, a super mega ultra shroom uh, sounds really tempting, but you want to say no to everything she, say, uh, she says, mainly for something that you're going to see right now. Good choice for my sake, this Merly is a total fake. Listen not, she is a snake. Me, 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 me. No point in trying to fool anyone now. Gee, looky here, the girl you thought was handmade or a Merly imposter. She's actually a faithful servant of Cal Black, Master Impersonator Mimi. Golly, I was hoping that you'd sell peacefully, but too bad. Oh, you want to take things this ugly, huh? Well, that's super. Let's get ugly. Drew, Mimi, come forth! Welcome to the creepiest thing I have ever seen in a Nintendo game. I don't play, uh, you know, a huge variety of games, but out of my entire gaming career, this is one of the creepiest things I have ever seen in any video game. I am not kidding. <laughs> so she's going to be yuck. Please, my friends, beware. A barrier protects me there. In fact, it's everywhere. I think that the text might be useless against such as she. Attacks won't work, huh? Uh, what shall we do? Me, 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 me. I must suggest you flee. Come to find the real me. I am hiding. Look and see. If you can, my magic may weaken her and win the day. Hurry, hurry, don't delay. And on that note, how about we just go chasing after this? Uh, <laughs> not chasing after this, but uh, how about we go uh, in search of, uh, you know, the real Merly in order for us to defeat, to defeat that ugly uh, incarnation of evil itself, Mimi. And uh, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. And uh, I really wanted to talk about, oh, okay, so... On my, you know, the the other uh, on on the other failed recording that I was talking to you guys about, I actually, uh, you know, tried uh, that thing out, which is a curse. Yeah, I'm going to be explaining that in a later episode, mainly because this is not exactly the the you know most perfect time to show you exactly what it is. But uh, right here, as you can see, those torches uh, torches are going to be able to. Oh God! And that that ugly thing is coming. If you get on, uh, if you get on uh, 3D, she's you know not going to be able to do jack shit to you. So if you actually go over here, you can do this uh, this for a uh, sort of uh, speed running tactics. We're going to be able to get into this door, but um, on the way to uh, Merley's place, I just wanted to uh, you know tell you guys about my weekend. And in the comments below, like you like you guys know, I read every single one of my comments. I want to know how was your weekend. I'm going to be telling you about my Sunday. Uh, personally, I woke up really, really, uh, really late, and I actually invited my girlfriend to uh, uh, to eat along with. Uh, well, I so so for example. I didn't invite, you know, just say, uh, <clears throat> I didn't invite every single one of them, but uh, I, I invited my my, uh, my girlfriend and uh, us, my sister and her boyfriend and, and, and my parents all ate in a restaurant, which is really, 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 really nice. Uh, we had like a really, um, like a really awesome triple, uh, triple date, if you want to call it that, because, um, like for example, something that I that I didn't really uh, mention is that uh, well, me and my girlfriend have been dating for I uh, um, and, and by the way, you want to uncover the stairs by doing that, which is pretty cool. So me and my and my girlfriend have been dating for a year and nine months now, and uh, 
my sister actually did not have a boyfriend until a month and a half ago. And that is something that, you know, really, really catched our attention because it's, you know, her first uh, formal boyfriend. And, you know, we are pretty happy for that. But now that, uh, you know, Saturdays and Fridays, you know, are dedicated to our, you know, respective couple or partner, <laughs> uh, if I if I may call it that. So, you know, my, uh, my parents are, again, you know, like a boyfriend and girlfriend. Uh, so <laughs> they're, you know, sort of all by themselves on, on, on the weekend except for Sundays. And, yeah, that's pretty cool. So in the comments below, just tell me how your weekend was, uh, how your Sunday was. I would, love to, I would love to hear about what you guys did. But uh, on that note, how about here in the bathroom we open this door? <laughs> Oh, look, it's the real Merly. Hey, found me, the real Merly. Yeah, that's what I just said. I shine on, such my lot, as sun to those faded to me brought. Oh, by the way, I have to mention that I, I'm not really good with rhymes, so that is actually why I might stumble on her text. <laughs> the real Merly, truly? In a place like this? I'm afraid that Mimi Freak was too robust and I too weak. The pure heart I quickly took and hit and hid where she would never look. But now you're here, hooray, this bad tide will turn today, soon that awful Mimi pays. You can, uh, you and I can j now join up, teach that tiny bratty pop a lesson, now let's power up. Oh, I don't think so. Uh, geez, I, I, I swear to god, that is one of the creepiest things I've seen in a Nintendo game. Mimi! Mimi, 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 and she's going to be impersonating again so uh, this like the first paper Mario is something that is not exactly interesting so I'm going to be rushing through the text they're going to be arguing about you know who the real Merle is and then you're going to be having some you know you're going to see in a second how we are going to be deciding who the real one is but uh, what they say right now is not important whatsoever so you can just uh, rush through and uh, yeah that's pretty cool um, now, one thing I wanted to talk about, uh, actually one of you guys uh, told me in the comments, you know, why have the the episodes been, you know, a little bit, oh, and this is what I, I was telling you guys about, uh, so, you are going to be uh, asking her, a, uh, well, asking both of them, a couple of, qu of, uh, a couple of questions, now, this doesn't really matter because at the end of the five questions, you're going to be seeing a clear uh, a proof of which uh, of which one of them is, you know, the the real Merly. So I'm going to rush through the questions, uh, you know, just talking about something that I found in the comments, and I will, you know, uh, continue with what we need to do in a couple of seconds. So you can just um, choose whatever question, and they will answer. This is not of you know extreme importance, but uh, what I was telling you guys, uh, well, um, what I was talking about is that one of you guys told me in the comments that you know the the episodes have been a little bit long lately and that is because we are sort of tight on the schedule for sticker star uh today is the 29th or 30th i believe so that leaves us with uh, like 40 days to sticker star and the gameplay uh, oh, and by the way, now we can choose who the real one is. And uh, so, yeah, the, uh, I mean, this is not exactly the longest Paper Mario, but I, I you know, I don't want to rush through it, but I don't want to, you know, be e extremely detailed about it because I really want to finish on time. So this is what I, uh, this is what I was telling you guys about the uh, the one who has a fly on her. She uh, she's going to be, you know, the real one because she came out of the bathroom, uh, you know, out of the toilet itself, which is pretty disgusting. <laughs> and um, so yeah, no question about that. And um, with the real, uh, well, with the fake Mimi busted, <laughs> fake Merly busted, she's going to do that creepy thing again, I swear after uh, recording this I'm going to edit this real fast and whenever I get to sleep that thing is going to be appearing in my nightmares I I am not kidding that is one of the grossest and most just that I don't uh, uh, um, oh, it's just, the, it, I mean no, 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 no it's just purely disgusting <laughs> So this is actually the uh, boss of chapter two. One really quick, uh, well, uh, one really nice strategy. Um, and, and by the way, those hearts are uh, the signal that uh, Merly actually weakened her now, so we can uh, actually attack her. Now, uh, what you want to do is uh, use Peach and uh, throw, as one of you guys uh, told me in the comments that it, it, you know it is actually pronounced a throw. 
and uh, you know, not Thoriel, but uh, yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty cool. Uh, one really nice uh, strategy that you, uh, that you want to use is uh, use Peach. I, I'm not really sure why I like to use Peach uh, in this battle, but uh, simply put, I. You know, it's, uh, I, I don't know, I mean, you can use Mario, but uh, Peach hasn't seen a lot of action lately. And uh, one thing we want to do is get her in the corner, and uh, once you get her in here, you've actually uh, won the battle. I mean, check this out, uh, look at how bad we are raping her ass. I mean, wow, that was a little vul uh, uh, vulgar, I am sorry. And look at this, she's done. <laughs> That was the I, I do believe that was the fastest uh, boss battle we've had so far including O chunks which was not even a main boss I mean it was like a, it was like a mid boss but but uh, actually this boss was a lot easier and with Mimi vanished fine job on that Mimi yes the pure heart saves evil repressed you know that Tendons here regarded it for uh, 1500 years, waiting for you to draw near. Finally, that duty is done, and my anomic sastic for one. But wait, here, finish up, I must tell you something, yep. So, the light pronosticus was read by you, yes? It was written that uh, I and my ancestors waited by the pure heart, staying spry. But something wasn't written there, and the uh, fit you must be aware. There is another prophecy. A heart of by chaos can only be beaten by four uh, of mystery. Four heroes unite. Their hope burns for the light to shatter the walls of blight. That is how despair it dies. Such is what we prophesy here in the home of the wise. Four heroes? I'm sure the pair of you, Mari and Peach. You two are the first, uh, the first of heroes, true. So then it falls to you to find the other heroes too. I would guess if I had to, the others might be known to you. Now, finally let me be. I hereby my to do my sworn duty. There, from me it parts. Here heroes, a pure heart. And with that, a really, really quick episode in my opinion to finish chapter 2. And we get another Your Heart. End of a chapter. Count Black served Mimi had laid a nasty trap for Mario and friends. But with the help of Merle, faithful defender of the Pure Heart, the day was won. But who were the other two heroes mentioned by Merle? With five pure hearts yet to be found, Mario knew this adventure had only begun. You want to save our progress? Yes, we do. But, as for right now, if you guys have watched the episode until now, and if you enjoyed, a like and a comment would be really appreciated. Favorite this video if you would like to watch it again. Subscribe if you want to watch more videos like this. And like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter to be notified on new videos whenever they come out the precise moment. So without any further ado, you guys have a great day. Take care of yourselves until my next video. When we get to uh, go to the interlude and maybe star chapter 3, I will see you then. Eight sixteen. so 2816. Passcode accepted. Let's open it. And look at how many rubies we are going to earn. Can you guess how many are <laughs> how many are going to be in there? Why? It is the precise, the awesome amount of one million rubies. There we go.